hey 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 everybody thanks for joining me on my channel today with amy's creative acrylics i am amy hello hello look at my messy hands <laughs> just trying to get some paintings done here um today i'm doing a pour this is on a 12 by 16 inch artist loft canvas my last video um i did these colors but with a black base and so i'm going to use a white base this time with the same colors i used last time which are um rustoleums metallic glacier blue deco arts metallic 24 karat gold and lick relics of uh, fluorescent blue sorry my table is a mess a really bad mess <laughs> And then I'm going to use Blick Relics uh, Turquoise. <clears throat> and this time I'm going to use it on a white base. And I don't necessarily want them to look exactly the same, which I don't know if you can ever get to um, paintings like this um, exactly the same. But I'm going to smear. And <clears throat> I'm using Amsterdam's Titanium White for my smear color. And I mix my paints two parts flow Floetrol to one part paint. And then I um, also add a little li um, Liquitex gloss pouring medium in there. I forgot to mention that in my last video. And then I use a little bit of water, depending on the thickness, to get the consistency that I want. Um, so let's get started. I'm going to start, I think I'm going to start with the turquoise. And let's see, I think I'm going to kind of go have to see a hair there. <laughs> Guess we're going to start right over the top of that, huh? All right, then I'm going to use the glacier blue. I kind of want to have a little bit of negative space. <clears throat> and then I'm going to use my gold. Which my, my cup is pretty full, so I'm just going to, oof, that was a lot. You have to be really careful with the metallic gold um, from Decarts. And maybe all metallic golds are that way, but it will really take over your painting. So, <clears throat> And then I'm going to use the, the fluorescent blue. All right, so okay. he's got to be right under my feet. So when I do, I use my palette knife. Um, I just put a little bit of white on my palette knife, and then I just let it kind of drip back off into here because I don't want it to be overly full of paint, if that makes sense. <clears throat> And then we're just going to lightly, you'll put your palette knife on top of the colors. You want to make sure you do it real lightly because if you push too hard, then you're going to pull that white up from underneath and then it kind of gets rid of all of your, all of your uh, colors there. I'm just going to use a palette knife and I dip it into my colors. And it's kind of cool you'll get this lacing on here from the from the white paint. That's under the bottom.
All right, I'm going to torch it a little bit, and then we're going to spin it and see if we can get some of those cells opened up. All right. And you don't want to spin it too terribly fast. Otherwise, your paints will go just flying off the, the canvas. And then you're going to have just, it's just going to spread out. You're not going to be able to keep any kind of composition that you're hoping to get. So, all right, here we go. We're going to spin it. Stuck in the past watching videos of us. I have been trying to get rid of your stuff But voices in my head are telling me to stop It's all I have left, all I have of you Thought I was more than a body to hold, baby I wanted you, wanted us to be something more I was so sure, let my guard down for you Baby, why'd you have to love me, love me like that? I gave you my heart you tore it apart Don't know why you had to hurt me Hurt me like that Cause now I'm messed up Drinking non-stop Just trying to forget you And everything we said But I can't seem to get these thoughts out of my head Baby, why'd you have to love me? Love me like that Love me like that Oh Staying inside in my bed all day long Listening to sad songs and feeling so low Thinking about you and where we went wrong Cause I wanna know why you let me go Thought I was more than a body to hold, baby I wanted you, wanted us to be something more. I was so sure, I let my guard down for you Baby, why'd you have to love me, love me like that? I gave you my heart And then you always want to make sure that you take a palette knife or popsicle stick or whatever kind of tool that you use and go around your edges. I do it. I'll do it after I take it off my thing, but you want to make sure you get all that drips off before so your um they don't keep getting pulled off the side and then you lose come back in and check on your painting and then half of it's been pulled off. So you want to keep doing that. Make sure I do it a couple times. <clears throat> I do it right away and then I come back in maybe like 15 20 minutes and I do it again. Just to check. Sometimes you don't have to do it a second time cuz it's all good. It doesn't have depending on how much paint you have on your on your canvas, you know, the more paint you have left on there, the more you're going to obviously have to do because there's a lot of paint there. So, but this is pretty cool. I like this one. Very cool. The cells are awesome, and then all that shimmer is just beautiful. All right, I'm going to bring you down for a close up. All right, so, whoops, here we go. I'm going to bring you down for a close up here. Just look at all that shimmer already. Deco Arts Metallic 24 Karat Gold. As my granddaughter would say, shimmer, shimmer. <laughs> I think I say this all the time. I apologize. <laughs> I do want to just real quick say um, how much I appreciate you guys' support for my channel. Um, I'm getting closer and closer to a thousand subscribers and um, I just appreciate your guys so much. Um, if you could, well, hopefully you have watched the full video and you, um, 
are helping me with my um, watch hours because you have to have 4,000 watched hours in order to get subscribed and then 1,000 subscribers. So, um, But I do thank everybody for joining me in today. Um, I do want to let you guys know that all my art is for purchase. If you're interested in any of my art or if you like a style but you want some different colors, um, you can email me at amyscreativeacrylics at gmail.com. Um, or you can message me on Facebook. My Facebook page is Amy's Creative Acrylics Johnson. Because <laughs> I didn't know how to do it right. And now I have my last name on there. <laughs> but uh, yeah, Amy's Creative Acrylic Johnson on Facebook. You can um, um, hit me up on there as well. So I do thank you guys for watching. Pink, do you want to say hello? pretty cool the cells are like so cool I like those with the with the um glacier blue it's kind of like wrapped around the gold there you got that fluorescent blue look at all that shimmer in there I do thank everybody for joining me today I hope you guys will enjoy this video and you did enjoy this video I should say and I hope everybody is being healthy and safe from COVID and just healthy in general. And I appreciate you guys watching so much. Have a good day. Have a good evening. And keep being creative. Bye-bye.